you've, you've flown a long way to be by our side. Yeah, it looks like the Dominion in Basil Basingstoke, doesn't it, really? <laughs> uh, anyway, welcome back. Thank you. It's nice to be home. Good to see you. And straight in, it, it's amazing, isn't it? It's the I fastest the last rising year. thing I've ever had, Terry. <laughs> uh, <laughs> don't start the musicians. No, no, off. right. No. I mean, I, in this very spot, as I said, you said, oh, I don't think I'll ever have a number one. And this well, one it isn't looks yet. Yeah, I know. No, I've got but John it... Barnes keeping me off at the moment. You have? Yes. <laughs> but it could... He's singing better than he's playing at the moment. So hopefully <laughs> on Saturday he'll, uh, he'll yeah. play and score I mean, goals. really, if he, if he does and they beat Holland, of course, then you have no chance of getting the number one. Well, no, because the sales are already counted for Saturday. Oh, see. So it's a very close race. Meanwhile, Pavarotti's creeping up on the outside. Well, hardly <laughs> creeping, but he's creeping. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you had to come back from, from it's America. It's nice to be in the charts with someone fatter than me. It's wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> so there isn't a when are you making a record? <laughs> there isn't. I have shown this man nothing but kindness okay. through the years. He comes on. I come Honestly, on, right? Yeah. He comes on very strong. I've never come on to you, darling. <laughs> no. Not on the television. Not on the anyway. television. No. No. Get no. out of here. Get you, out of here. You right. kissed me the last time I you were on. What are you talking about? So soon you forget. Yes. But anyway, you're the picture of robust good health. Thank you. And I'm delighted that the, you're here only, obviously, to see the football so that you can get a proper view. No, I'm here to, well, come. They don't show much football in America, even though exactly. the Americans are in the uh, championships and played very well last night. They don't really have much support back home, which is a shame. And, but I've come home to do Nebworth as well, which is the charity thing on the end of June. And yes, we've got the very man that you're helping yeah. coming on very short, Dr. Clive Robinson. Very... What, do you think, what do you think of the old World Cup? I mean, are you still backing England or the Cameroons? Um, the Macaroons. <laughs> um, the Macaroons. So, so the best team I've seen so far are the Cameroons. That's right. I, it's, it's, it's very hard in the first few rounds to be diplomatic. First few rounds, uh, nobody wants to really lose, so you've seen some pretty dull games. I think the football will get much better uh, after the next round. I hope it will. It's been pretty drastic. It's been pretty bad, I think. Do you think so? Yeah. Oh, I it's... just find it riveting. I just love it. You do, yeah. yeah. You, it, it is actually riveting. You can't stop watching it. It numbs you into sleep. Like, I mean, <laughs> only this afternoon, Terry, as I was reading your autobiography. <laughs> <laughs> I was awoken by the sound of go. Um, <laughs> go to Flo. Go to Flo. You'll make him worse. He's been preparing this for years. <laughs> it's my fifth attempt. I should be good. <laughs> now tell me, your, this record, you, you are giving the proceeds, aren't you? Yes, uh, to four different AIDS charities. Yeah. Um, and every single I shall release henceforth from any album will be. Uh, towards charity. Um, Excellent. Because I think it's about time. I'm at that age where I can uh, definitely afford to do it, and it's about time I did it. So every, any single from an album now in this country will go to charity. Yeah, I will. I know you were deep, deep. My manager has now fainted in the dressing room. <laughs> 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 I know you were... However, this is the last single I should be releasing in the film. Sorry, Tom. Carry on. Don't let me put you off. I don't know. What do you mean about these it's shoes? It's worse you're getting, as they say. Now, no. I was going to say, you, you've, uh, you've been very involved. We saw the involvement with Ryan White, mm -hmm. for instance. That, uh, that seemed to deeply affect you. Yeah, I mean, once you spend a lot of time in a children's hospital, not just kids with AIDS, but in um, an intensive care unit, um, you realise how lucky you are. And... Uh, uh, that did change my life, not just because of Ryan, but seeing some of these kids. And uh, it's very important to try and help. In yeah, I think any it's way important possible. to point out that it wasn't a question of jumping in the bandwagon because you, you heard the Ryan White story a couple of years ago, got involved. You played at the, at the funeral, I remember. Yeah, I, really, I, went to, I went to Indianapolis because there was nothing I could do for Ryan. I went there to help his mother because she really had no mm. support. So we, um, I went and helped arrange the funeral and everything. I'd never had to do that before, so it, it was very good for me to actually go through that experience. Yeah. Uh, it was a sad experience, but a, tough in, a toughening one. And it opened my eyes a lot, and uh, I, I made a pledge that uh, from that point on I'd try and do as much as I could. You're also helping the Romanian orphans? From... Yeah, we have an album coming out for the Romanian orphans, uh, a lot of which have AIDS, these kids. They just put them in a room and forget about them. And I'm sure you've seen the newsreel footage, it's pretty horrific. Yeah. So the Travelling Wilburys, George Harrison and all the Beatles' wives, got together and started this thing with me for the for Romanian orphans. And there's a great album coming out with Guns N' Roses and stuff like that. Uh, Excellent. So, yes. And the Nebworth... 
Uh, that's that's, that's music up. therapy. When's that coming up? That's coming out the end of June. I don't know the date, but it's this last Saturday in June. Oh, who's going to be involved in that? Oh, Elsie, Elsie and Doris Waters, but I'm afraid one of them died yesterday. Oh, dear. <laughs> You see, they're, uh, they're they're gods and ruins it all, you see, don't they? Mind you, they were, some, they were some of the youngest people on the act. I've never been on a show with so many old people on it. I think... <laughs> <laughs> You're not comparing it, are you? <laughs> never, always the bad. Always the bad. No, George pulled out yesterday, having, I think he got nappy rash. Um, <laughs> uh, but no, it's, it should be good. I'm playing with Eric Clapton and Mark Knopfler in, in that band. There's Genesis, there's Phil Collins, there's McCartney, there's The Floyd, there's Status Quo, there's Tears for Fears. Uh, there's quite a few acts. It should be a really good day. You, s you are... If we keep the meat away from the McCartneys, that is. Yeah. <laughs> it's quite... Very important. <laughs> very important. Don't yes. let them see that. No, don't let them see yeah. the meat. Well, it's, it's, been, it's been grand to talk. <laughs> it's been grand to, to get a word in sideways with, with the grand old man of English pop. And, Thank and you. How could... As we said, age shall not wither. No. And it hasn't. Uh, <laughs> and for the moment... Well, thank you for the moment.